P, what's up, bro? Good morning from New Jersey, where it is currently nuking outside. But we love this because all this east wind, all this rain, this storm is just bringing surf to us. Tonight, the wind is gonna shift offshore, blow the other direction. We're gonna have offshore barrels before dark, and then tomorrow we're gonna have offshore barrels all day long. I might make some crazy moves today, try to find some barrels, but I might just stick around and surf in the bay because there could be some potential there. And I'd be stoked for that. We gotta go check it all out. But uh, as of right now, kinda getting some side chip rained on and uh, I got a lot of comments to answer. I got coffee to make and I got a lot of preparing to do. So, hope you guys are ready. The storm starts today. There's gonna be waves today, tomorrow, the next day, the next day, the next day for, for days. So, we're amping. Good morning, Nub Nation for the win! Woo! And uh, yeah, this is heavy. Alright, so in the car right now and I'm going full commitment, heading down to Heritage Surf Shop. I think they're going to have a board that I can borrow, but if not, fully willing to buy myself a new nine footer because um, sadly the Ben Gravy doesn't come out for two weeks. So I'm not going to just sit here and hold myself back because my board's not out. You know, I got to chase the novelty. So pretty much what I'm doing is I'm going down to Heritage. I'm going to see what they got. If they have a board that I can fully ride, I am 100% on that thing because can't be holding myself back over not having the board. Even if it's not the Ben Gravy Wave Bandit, I still need to be getting the novelties. This is commitment in its finest for the dream. Here we go. It's like thigh hot. <laughs> no joke. There it is. That thing? Yeah. How big is it? Nine. Nine foot? Perfect. What's going on? <laughs> I literally, when I was coming over the bridge, I like stopped for a second and checked the nine mile. <laughs> All right, the boys here at Heritage Margate were gracious enough to hook me up with this nine foot log. Thing's a little beaten and battered, but so is my life. So we're gonna take it and I got a surprise for you guys. So this is pretty exciting morning we got going on right now for the dream. How are you gonna fit in my van? Ew. Thanks Heritage. They also gave me this epic t-shirt, Heritage Margate, New Jersey, 1962. The heaviness is real. Dude, is this, no. is this the guy right now? What's the claim? Dude, you tell me. Are you at the river? <laughs> nah, I bailed. Dude, f you. What's up, dude? <laughs> <laughs> you. Dude. All right, so we're here. I'm trying to make some peanut butter toast before we go hit this novelty wave, and I literally can't contain my life because I'm so excited. <laughs> but we got JP O'Brien back. Yo, I got the jelly. Homemade. Who, was, who made it? Uh, Mary Jo made it. Mary Jo's jelly. <laughs> so he was out on a boat for like a year. Now he's back. So I'm I'm ready for my toast. All right, inspiring quote of the day. I just got this email to me. You don't make progress by standing on the sidelines, whimpering and complaining. You make progress by implementing ideas. It's pretty heavy. Because what are we doing right now? We're implementing a new idea, dude. This is just groundbreaking stuff. This is a wave out in the middle of the bay that most people would drive by and say, hmm, hmm. I ain't gonna drive by it. <laughs> I drove by it the other day and was like, what the hell is that? And called you immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this is so sick. We're amping. Look at the sideways one. Oh my God. You're gonna do a turn. You're gonna do an actual turn. Dude, I'm gonna nuke it. Look how long that wave's breaking. Oh my gosh. Wow. Reform. 
guys, so this is that bay wave that I surfed the other day in the fog when it was just like totally zero visibility and I went out with my GoPro. But thank God we have JP here to actually showcase what this wave is. It's literally out in the middle of a bay. There's a sandbar and there's no beach. There's no beach. I'm jumping off the dock and I'm going out into the middle of a bay. And it's literally like a mile from where the ocean starts. <laughs> like the paddle is no joke. Like I'm paddling my off to get out there and we're going to make it happen. I am amping. So for the dream, guys, wish me luck. And uh, follow JP on Instagram at JP O'Brien DV. You for the dream. What you know about this bad, this bad boy? What is it? 11 to 16. Movie magic. What time is it? Uh, 11.50. All right. I will be out there at high noon. High noon. On my first wave. <laughs> 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 Okay, so this wave is breaking out in the middle of the bay. There's no beach, there's no anything, except we're in the middle of the bay and there's a sandbar. So these waves I'm catching here will pretty much just break as far as the sandbar lets them. As long as there's shallow sand, these waves are gonna break. And the cool thing about this is, this south swell's pushing directly across the sandbar and it's just pushing through. So there's nothing deterring these waves from just continuous, continuously rolling. And they'll just roll all the way in there till the sandbar ends. So one of the cooler novelty waves I've ever seen. I'm really excited about this, guys. Hope you're having fun. <laughs> Yeah, legend has it that there is a wave out there by mile marker three. Like, yeah! <laughs> When you're waiting for a wave out here, there's nothing around you. So it's pretty psychological. Fog, open water, more open water, and the occasional wave. <laughs> Thank you.
right here? This is because the slack tide is over and the incoming tide has started coming in. It's pushing super hard. So I made a crazy discovery. This is a slack tide wave. You have to surf it between the tides. And slack tide doesn't always exist at every location because sometimes it just goes from high to low. But look at this, look at this. Oh my God, I'm so far off the buoy now. I just got pushed so far within a matter of the 26 seconds that I was filming this clip. So pretty much this wave just told us it done. Stoked guys, thanks for coming along for the ride. We scored another one. Novelties for life. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go up there and check out the point. You just started pushing me inside and sucking me, believe it or not, towards the beach. So Whoa. that's a full slack tide wave. Literally, it's probably like 38 and a half minutes you can surf that every day. <laughs> <laughs> we nailed it, dude. Woo. Thanks, dude. Of course. That was radical. That was like a minute long wave. Oh, man. Just disappeared like that. Thumbs up. This is Skeleton Bay. And when Skeleton Bay breaks, the goal is to go from rock pile all the way under that dock over there. And guess what? We're about to do that. Break? Yeah. Okay, just so you That's what makes them break. Oh, I surf here all the time. Oh, all right. I'm yeah, I'm a professional no I'm a professional novelty hunter. Okay. You know what that is? Novelty wave? Yeah. It's like a quirky weird weird wave. Oh, okay. Cuz this is the bag. Technically, I know, I know. here I'll show you. Are you guys hanging out for a minute? Yeah. I'll show you what I got. Oh no, that won't be necessary. Those ladies don't believe in me. literally walked over to cast in the path of where Ben's gonna surf. Like there's a bunch of there's a bunch of fishermen that came and they're just casting their lines like in Ben's way.
Captain Bay, dude. That was pretty mental, actually. What do you think? Kind of sick. There's a lot of energy right now. I know it's crazy. I wonder what. Uh... in many many years I am actually gonna try to shortboard at Skeleton Bay. What's up boss? Hi, how are you? What do you think? <laughs> what a legend. Alright we're out there. You
you know it's gnarly about life? The refractor is going bonkers right now. Don't you think? <laughs> Down the left. Dude. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Dude, it just never ends. Good luck zooming on that. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Zoom. I don't know. I think I think we're at that point in the tower. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Perfect. Good to talk to you, actually. Yeah. Thanks. You too. Um, great job on um, uh, your YouTube channel. I, I'm so glad you're doing it. Uh, there's not a lot of... Um Ladies and gentlemen, we are driving through the dark and misty night. But where are Make we going? Make a U-turn at Shoe Avenue. Then the destination is on your right. But where are we going? Find out tomorrow morning for the win.